Oh, there we go. Well, I'm in my truck, and I'm uh, on my way to my mother's house to cut her grass. I do that every couple of weeks. And I'm not my grass. I got Cole here with me. He's hopping around in the back seat back here. I had to put him back there so he wouldn't be distracting me. But uh, anyway, oh, it's been a hell of a couple of months or whatever. You know. I've been working on this job for a couple of months now. It's really, it's not hard work. It's not even that physical, it's more mental. And plus the fiberglass, the stuff itches. I hate itching, you know. So anyway, but it got me this truck. You know, um, I don't know if you've been watching my channel, but uh, my um, my car got rear-ended when I was in Florida, trying to escape the winter last year. So I had to cut my trip short and come back um, because I was ill-prepared for that hit, you know. So got back here. I didn't even have a vehicle. I had to borrow my mother's car. So which saved me. So I was able to get a job and work. And um, fortunately my credit wasn't too bad. So uh, after a month's worth of work and um, saving my money and uh, working, oh, I ended up working two jobs. I worked for People Ready too and whatever. Worked on a regular job and a uh, temp job. I worked every weekend for the last three, four months. Every Saturday and Sunday. <laughs> and um, Work straight through seven days on a day off. And um, two months later, I got a vehicle, you know. So, I mean, it wasn't easy, but, you know, there's no reason not to have a car, you know. But, um, of course, I don't have any bad driving record or uh, my credit is decent, you know. So, that's a, a big difference, you know. Whereas somebody else might have bad credit or no credit or you know, bad driving history or whatever, or the license have been taken because of drunk driving or whatever. I don't have that problem. But um, I'm on track now to next year or this year, going back to Florida again. I don't know if I'm gonna go from Florida or not, or I might go someplace different. I'm comfortable with Florida because I can get, I know I can get a job there. You know, people ready. I worked with them for a couple of months down there and they like me. And they'll give me a job, the job I was on, they like me. And um, I'll probably go back and try to get that same job back again if possible. If somebody else doesn't have it already, it was a really good job, you know. But life got me. So anyway, um, I don't know how people do this. You know, this camera vlogging in the car while they're driving. This ain't easy. Just getting the camera set up. Whatever. Well, actually, I use my phone for everything, or whatever. So just getting that set up where it wouldn't fall down while I'm doing it was a challenge and keeping him out of the way so he don't jump all over or grip it down from there that's a challenge you know and setting it up you know before it cuts off or times out that's a challenge you know so hope you guys appreciate this video i uh, just thought i'd make one right quick just to see if i could do it see if it worked and um so more 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 videos to come whatever on my um quest for going back to florida this year or i may go out west, I'm like going to California, but I may I may try to do uh, quartzite or um, um, Slab City. Thinking about trying to get to Slab City, I like to I always like to check that out. I want to go to Grand Canyon. I've never been to Grand Canyon. I like to see that, you know, one day before I die. But um, the rate I'm going, I don't know. It's gonna cost some money and some serious planning get that done but we'll see anyway I gotta pay attention to my driving the light I got the light everything so thanks for watching I'll see you on the next one